Hi there, I'm Jeffrey Rhodes from Experimental Homestead or Exotic Gardening and SherryAnnRichardson.com. Please subscribe, hit that join button, join our membership. Uh, whew. Well, turned into a fairly nice day today. Um, started off kind of chilly, but uh, once the sun came out, um, warmed things up a bit. Um, I was able to get the chickens outside for a little while today. Um, and uh, they managed not to wander off. Um, this was one of our concerns was that, you know, they weren't going to be familiar with the yard and, you know, they might fly over the fence or just, you know, kind of wander off. But uh, they all stayed, you know, really close. And uh, once it, you know, started getting later, they uh, they all made their way back up to the barn. So this was a good thing. Uh, now, if tomorrow is nice again, I'll probably let them back out again tomorrow and uh, give them a chance to, to wander again. Um, we uh, took a little drive over to Jonesboro and Gas City. Um, the uh, traffic was crazy, um, both places. Jonesboro, of course, has Main Street blocked off from 2nd Street down I'm not sure how far. I don't know whether it extended past 9th Street or not. Um, we didn't check. Um, but uh, basically it's River Rally in Jonesboro. That's a uh, motorcycle gathering. Um, so there were all sorts of motorcycles everywhere. Uh, and they have all sorts of events, you know, dealing with motorcycles as well. Um, we made our way over to Gas City. Um, we didn't do our usual route. Um, we didn't actually go down uh, on the main stretch there by the park. Um, we kind of went around the edge a little bit and then turned away rather than going down the, the main way to uh, look at what was going on because traffic was just, it was already terrible just getting over to where we were so lots of people lots of cars um ducktail looked to me from from my vantage it looked like it was um doing quite well this year um a lot bigger and better than it has been um for a little while um much bigger turnout uh, but it was just, you know, too crowded, really. And, uh, since Sherry's still not feeling real well, which was part of why we were just driving around, um, we decided, you know, we didn't want to park anywhere and walk. Um, we decided we didn't, we didn't really want the fair food, um, or the, the, the food vendor uh, food that was available. Uh, tenderloin sounded kind of good, but at the same time, it didn't really, you know. Uh, and she didn't know whether she would have been able to eat it anyways, so. But there's been a lot going on, so. But we just kind of, you know, looked around a little bit, but not much. Uh, we, uh, we came home and, uh, you know, kind of puttered around here a little bit. Uh, I've been doing several loads of laundry, uh, just trying to get some stuff caught up, um.
the uh, you know the animals were kind of fun dealing with today. You know, I liked kind of liked getting the chickens out, um, and they kind of follow me around when I'm out there. Uh, so, you know, at one point I I took a little walk around the pasture area, and they were all kind of following me. So, I'm not completely sure why they insist on following me, but uh, they kind of do that. So, uh, I'll use that to my advantage, I guess, because it makes it easier for them to me for me to get them back to the barn uh, when it's time to close them up. So, but. Anyways, uh, I think that's going to do it for tonight. I'm tired again. And, uh, so I think I'm going to call it a night. So once again, please subscribe. Uh, give us thumbs up, thumbs down, comments below. And uh, we will see everybody tomorrow. Stay safe out there.